Sixth Wednesday, Jesus the Healer. He stood over her and rebuked the fever. There are many challenges and problems in human life. When one faces any trouble, he she seeks someone who can provide suitable solutions. As Christians, who do we seek out when we encounter obstacles or difficulties in any kind? Who do we confide our problems in? In all certainty, we all are expected to move towards Jesus in today's gospel. We see that the followers of Jesus openly confide in him their concerns because they are concern, certain that he can solve any issue, trouble or difficulty. The mother-in-law of Simon is healed as a result of a prayer made to Jesus. Jesus listened to and responded to the request of the people. Do we approach Jesus with expectant faith? Do we allow him to be the healer in our life? Jesus is the healer who is constantly eager and ready to heal us. His healing power not only restores our health but also enables us to serve others actively. When he touches the ill, they experience his kindness and compassion. They feel loved and expected. In the first reading, St. Paul expresses gratitude to the Colossians for their steadfast devotion and love for Jesus. As they learned about Jesus, their lives were radically changed. They were able to love and serve others, others following the example of Jesus. Let us pray that we come to Jesus in our challenges and difficulties and be filled with the Holy Spirit so that we may help and be blessing to others who are struggling. Pray and practice. Lord, help us to recover from all illnesses and make us free so that we may serve you joyously and with generosity.